I'm in Oxfordshire, on the south lawn of Blenheim Palace. It's not a bad place to be, but on this particular occasion, I'm here to photograph trees. I do a lot of photography throughout the year at this place, but there's nothing more delightful than being here in autumn and photographing these majestic specimens they have here. Everywhere you look, it's just a magnificent display of autumn colors. These Lebanese cedars here were planted by Lancelot Capability Brown back in the mid 1700s. What a fantastic name. These trees are so big that you'd think I'd be using a wide angle lens all the time, but I don't. Sometimes I'll use a really long lens just to compress the perspective and frame up a little section of the shot, the tree in front and the trees behind and the landscape, really to make something interesting out of the picture. Even a lot of smartphones nowadays have three lenses on them. So it's not always about using fancy equipment. The most important thing is waiting for the right light and the right atmosphere and that magic moment. Perfect opportunity for a long lens shot right there. The South Lawn has literally hundreds of trees. So many different varieties here. Some really look like they've got faces and they're looking at me. Just like this example here. Not so big, but no less beautiful. Ancient. Looks like a dragon's head to me. This is one of my favorites here. It's like a little bonsai tree just defying gravity. I've photographed it many times in different conditions, different lighting, and it seems like the sheep and the pheasants love it too. I got this picture one winter, and the sheep were just circling around and around it. Perfect shot. Everywhere I look here, there seems to be a great photo opportunity but I need eyes in the back of my head in case I miss something. I just love walking through autumn leaves this time of year. I think this pheasant does too. Another technique I like to use is a very wide aperture on my lens, so it gives a very shallow depth of field and I can focus just maybe on one leaf or a branch. It just gives it a really lovely look. I always like to look for the unusual too, like this one little plant here growing amongst all these other glorious, colorful ones. Walking around in nature certainly gives us more time to reflect on things. And I think this year, we certainly need it more than ever. It's a very strange and uncertain time in the world right now, for obvious reasons. But for me as a photographer, being out in nature has certainly helped me pull through it. And all I can say is whether you're a photographer or not, just get out there and enjoy what you see around you, particularly this time of year. It's just amazing. And it's good for the soul.